Hi everyone, it's Linda and I am here at work already. I've been here all week. I haven't had a day off, which is fine. Um, it's almost Easter and you know everybody's coming in talking about how they have Easter plans and this and that and I'm, I'm just over here like I really don't have anything planned for Easter. No dinners, nothing. Um, I actually talked to my daughter and uh, I think we're gonna go for a hike at the Garden of the Gods um, and then eat lunch out and enjoy nature. Uh, that's what we're gonna do. Uh, anyway, <laughs> I did actually get to go shopping after work yesterday. I went to Tuesday morning and bought a few things and woo, extreme close up. And bought a few things, so I'm going to show you what I got. First off, I got this on clearance, and it's just some um, six by six papers. Um, feels more like a heavier, heavier weight paper, like cardstock. Ninety-nine cents, and it was on clearance, so I got that even cheaper. <laughs> I'll take it. I got this huge and it's cardstock. It already has the fold in the center, so all you have to do is make your card, decorate them however you want, and you have tons of different colors to choose from. And it's from the Cardstock Warehouse Paper Company, and it's acid free, lignin free, archival quality type, so you could use this, and it was only. $1.99. I got this. This is typeset paper pad. It includes two each of 18 paper designs and it's by Basic Gray. And it was only $1.99 for this 6x6 paper pad. And it's not double sided, which is fine. Um, I like buying the 6x6 six six paper pads because then I don't have to cut down all my 12x12s 12 for, you know, that. And I don't mind cutting down my 12x12 12 12 paper pads. That's not it. It's just, this saves me time. <laughs> I have little time to do anything lately. I really need more time. Okay. There's that one thing I wanted to show for sure that I can't find it. I found this do-it-yourself shop chalk vinyl tape. It's originally $3.49. It was said compare at $6.99, but look, it was on clearance. So I, I don't even think I paid $1.50 for it. And there were more, but I don't, I have trouble being able to use up everything I have right now. I actually probably shouldn't have went shopping for craft supplies yesterday, but I don't care. I don't care. Got these jelly stickers because my daughter just had to have these. I don't know why she loves these jelly stickers. 99 cents, not a big deal. These are simple stick repositional rubber stamps and they are, um, they were $2.99, but they were on, on clearance, and those are the stamps. So they were on clearance. And then I got this 15 Simple Stick Repositional Rubber Stamp, and it was $3.99, but it was on clearance. And I just had to have it for the guitar, and that it says totally strong and these are like griffins down there so yeah original genuine rock star love it love it love it love it love it and then I found this three pack of studio G journaling cards and some of them say happy day, well two of them say happy day and the other one have these buttons on them and then it says family fun list on the back and that one says hello beautiful. But that's the back. That one 
it says happy day and the back of that is just that oh man it's hard to see i'm so sorry guys and that one says happy day and on the back hello beautiful but yeah it was 99 cents and then it was on clearance so it was even cheaper than that and then i found these maggie holmes crepe paper 12 bow embellishments and they were only $1.99 and it says compare it $4.99 it's just these little bows various colors and stuff and then I got two of this same kind of um, ephemera pack it's crepe, crepe paper wonder 59 ephemera pack and it's $1.49 I, I love ephemera packs. I do. Because <laughs> you can just, you know, make even more embellishments with those. And then the last thing I got was this Prism Designer Chipboard Stickers. And this is the one that has the chipboard lettering in the back. And on the front, it has these. So yeah, it says everything is better with you is one of those. It's my favorite memories, interesting notes, awesomeness, cool stuff that happened. Yeah, 99 cents for that. They had tons more. Um, I only got one. I'm trying to uh, not spend as much. As I said, I'm, I, I really need to look for a new place to live. And uh, yeah, so all in all, I do still have the receipt in here. Sorry, I keep going off camera. All in all, I say I only spent seventeen eighty five. So yeah, the journaling cards were seventy nine cents. The six by six cardstock was only seventy nine cents. The washi vinyl tape was only a dollar thirty nine. Um. Yeah, so, and the other one, it was the, either way, the other one, I saved $1.80, it was only $1.19, so anyway, yeah, so, I didn't even spend $20 there, and I'm, I'm quite proud of that, so, yeah, you can get it for cheaper, never play, never pay full price, I mean, never, there's just no, no need to, there's so many deals you can get out there, anyway, that's pretty much my haul, I know I'm talking a lot, uh, one last thing I have to say, I had this um, dream last night, and have you ever had one of those dreams when you wake up and you and it's like an epiphany, because you're, you're just wondering, where did that come from, why am I feeling this way, etc, etc. So yeah, I had this epif <laughs> epiphany of a dream last night, and I'm not going to go into it, because my video is already running about eight and a half minutes. But, yeah, if you'd like to know what it was about, I'll, I'll gladly tell you. And one of the things that was said to me in the dream was, if you never try it, how are you going to know? Or, yeah, how are you? No, he said, if you never try it, how are you going to taste what it feels like? You know, I guess I was, anyway. It was an epiphany when that was said to me in my dream last night. It was, it was a, a wake-up call. How are you going to know if you never try it? Try new things, people. You never know. Anyway, also, please don't shop. Adopt a pet today. There's so many out there that need your love and care. Don't shop. Look for an adoptable dog. They are wonderful. I have three that are amazing. You know, none of them are full-blooded anything. They are just the best dogs I have ever had. So yeah, have a great day. Have a great Easter. I hope you do something fun. As I said, I'm going to go to the Garden of the Gods and go hiking and then have lunch. And that's going to be my Easter for the, this year. And I'm okay with that. So be okay with who you are and what you're doing, guys. Have a great day.